You know, if nine years of bad relationships hadn't have turned me into a cold, heartless bastard, that would have really bothered me. Probably already figured this out by now, but 9S is ridiculously easy to cheese with. Which is just fine by me. I mean, some of the funnest times I've had running around in Yoko Taro's ideal vision of a hopeful, war-torn future where there are no and there are nothing but androids and machines to fill in the void have been really fun. Not to say that any part of this game isn't fun, but come on, it's near Automata. What do you expect? Fishing sim? <laughs> oh, wait. Oh, God. That, that's right, there is a fishing sim in this. Shit. Well, I guess we're gonna be here for a minute. And it's another tiny killifish thing. Great. Okay, let's go do something else. While you guys were off doing cool things, I've been here fishing for tires. Because that's all there is, is fucking tires. Check back in in another 30 minutes. We'll see if there's anything good, alright? Uh, in the meantime, hold on, let me fucking... Roll the clip! God! Gotta do everything around here? <laughs>
Hypothesis. Garbage. Pod, the decisions that I make with my life are not yours to question. So please, shut the fuck up. Oh, dish! It's a fucking pod! Is this a pod? It is a fucking pod! The owner discarded this pod and left it in safe mode. I've been trying to get a hold of this thing for like. Pod, reset this and check the original owner ID. Activation complete. Access hours. Oh man, oh man, oh man. I wonder what kind it is. What is that? <gasps> it's a freaking laser! It's a freaking pod with a freaking laser beam. So the moral of the story here, kids, is that sometimes being patient pays off. Even if it hurts a lot. Like a lot, a lot. Seriously, you have no idea how boring fishing can be sometimes. At any rate, this is your good buddy, the Green Knight, a.k.a. Pope Lunas, a.k.a. whatever the fuck you want to call me. And I hope you enjoyed this horrible piece of crap video that I just managed to poop out in maybe six hours or something. I don't fucking know anymore. I hope you enjoyed this episode of Nearly There, and you know, maybe there'll be more, maybe there won't. Hey, Rick, see you next time.